Hey guys, so I'm going to show you how to curl your American Girl Dolls hair. And I know I've done this video a couple other times, but this problem always comes up. Some people can't, like when they roll the hair up, they can't get it to stay up here. So there's actually two different ways you can roll it up. And if you don't roll it up the way I do, you're going to have to bobby pin it differently. So before we get started, what you're going to need is... Oh, before you ask, her dress is from Buzz and Bee. You are going to need a something round to roll her hair up on. I just have this old mascara tube that I don't use. Doll hairbrush, of course. Bobby pins. And some water in a spray bottle. What you're going to do is, if your doll's hair is already curly like this, you're just going to grab... Grab the curl, and then you're going to roll it up. If your doll's hair is brushed out, you're going to need to section off her hair. So to do that, just take your thumbs, and then you're going to go right behind her ear, and you're going to go across the back of her head and meet your thumbs in the middle. And you sectioned off her hair, and then once you do that, you just take sections and brush it out and roll it up and stuff like that. So grab your section of hair, and you're going to spray it with some water. Oops. You can hear my brother crying. Sorry about that. Alright, and then... Brush it out. Now, you're going to take your tube, your roller, curler, and then what you're going to do is wrap it, just put it on the top, and then it curls around like that. Bring up, hold on, let me redo that. Wrap this part around like that. And then you're just going to hold this part underneath and roll it underneath this hair. And then you're going to roll it all the way up. Pull out your curler. Call it a curler. I'm going to call it a curler. So now you're holding it. Take your bobby pin and put it through the top. Like that. And then you can do this if you want. You don't have to. You're going to do that to the other side of the pin curls and just put it through the other side like that. So that way it's more secured. So now I'm going to show you the second way you can roll it up. I don't do this way. It's more difficult for me. So you spray it down. that brush it out so now what you're going to do for this is you're going to have the hair you're going to put your curler on top of it this time and then have the hair go over it like this and then you're going to roll the hair up so you can see the ends at the top here you're just going to roll that up into this piece and then just roll it up to the top of her head take that out bobby pin and I'll put it through one way like that oopsies actually you're gonna pin it on the bottom my bad I'm so used to doing it the other way pin it on the bottom so that it stays. And then you're going to do the other side if you want to. So I used to do it the other way, I just did it on the top. It wouldn't have stayed. So that's how you do both. And then when you're done, you can leave these in as long as you want. If you don't like waiting, you can just wait till the hair dries. But my friend, she 
um, did a video like this too and she just left them in for maybe an hour and they weren't fully dry yet but she still took them out. Um, but you will get something that looks like this. Less messy but when you take, so you take it out, let it fall by itself and then you're just going to finger curl it with your finger and just let it fall. Obviously it would look nicer if it was dry but I can show you again when it's dry what it looks like. But yeah that's basically how I do it um, was the first way I showed you. And the second way make sure you pin it on the bottom don't pin it on the top otherwise it won't stay. I think that's where people got confused they rolled it up different way that I did in the video so um let me show you something that my friend showed me her channel is living that AG life I'll link her below she's amazing okay so you're gonna need a toothbrush unused and what you're gonna do is spray the bristles When she showed this in her video, I was like, oh my gosh, that really works. So if you take the pin curls out and you have like all of this sectioning off at the top of her head, as you can see, what you can do is just take your wettened toothbrush and just brush it down like this. Just brush the hair with the toothbrush and should get rid of flyaways too. So if you just brush top of her head like this. It should get rid of most, if not all, flyaways. Spray it a couple times. And you can see how the flyaways kind of not disappear, but kind of flatten. You can use your hand too if you want to kind of get rid of some of them. So that I would share her little idea that she came up with and it's her idea not mine I'm actually gonna do her whole head my way and then I'm gonna show you what these look like when they're dry um but yeah I will see you guys for the results portion of this video hey guys so um I'm gonna now show you um what the curls look like when you take them out here's what I normally do and then this one is what the other way of rolling it up could look like. So take it out and you can let it fall by itself but if you want it to make it look nicer what you can do is just take your finger and finger curl it. And I do the same with her hair as I do with Caroline. Just take the curl, twirl it once, grab the hair and then continue twisting it. And if the bottom's still a little bit messy, you can do it a couple more times. Just like that. And I'll show you this one. Which will let kind of fall by itself. This, if you do it the second way that I showed you, it will curl a different way. So like you saw with this curl, I had curled it to the right and then with this one it curls to the left if you saw that so it goes this way instead so if you want to change up your doll's curls like the direction that it goes just do the second way and it'll go to it'll just go the other way that the other one doesn't if that makes sense that's basically it and you can leave these in for as long as you want I know my friend Le only leaves them in for like an hour or so. Um, she only does that because she doesn't want like the hair to look parted up at the top. So I'm going to take out these um, pin curls. These I left in for probably, I'll put it on the screen for sure, but I think it was like two, two, three days maybe. Not necessarily the longer you leave them in, but if you leave it in for like a month, it, I don't think it would be any curlier than if you left it in for like a week or even a couple days. And hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope it helped you. I know I did this for like the third time, but comment, rate, and subscribe. Bye!